Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing well. In today's episode, episode number nine of our Bobby Brazilian Bobby. It's not Bobby Brazilian Bobby. It's just Brazilian Bobby. But in today's episode, we have a new event to look at, and we have some packs to open as well. And we are not going to be playing any games today. It's going to be relaxed, chill episode where we just do some event thingies, and then we look at some. exchanges and all that good stuff guys so let us get into this event hope you guys have enjoyed the past few episode hope you guys are doing well and if you guys uh, enjoy the video please do hit that like button and hit that subscribe button as well now our pass the first thing we're going to look at is the pass it's pretty boring i'm not going to lie libertadores event was not an event that i liked in the last uh, last editions of uh, fifa but You know what? The card design looks decent. It doesn't look too. Uh, it doesn't look like they're trying too hard, but it looks like it's a decent card design. And there are some interesting players as well. So the first thing we're gonna do is go and see exchange. In this exchange, will we get anything interesting? No, it's gonna be only annual three players. Okay, we'll finish this first then, and then we'll go look at what we can do with the new event. I don't know if we have enough things to open the packs and stuff. But first, we'll do the limited exchange, and then uh, I think we'll be able to open some other exchanges as well. So yeah, in today's episode, basically a lot of openings of packs and stuff is gonna be there, guys. Uruguay, right? Tumidu, who is this? 85, please. You're not 85, 97. Why 85 is not even there? I don't know why I am asking for 85. Okay, now where is this even? Libertadores. Con me bol, Liberty Dores. Now you have to play a lot of games, I guess, for this, in order to finish. You know all these things. So you do this, you do this, you claim this, you claim this, and you finish this. Group stage, you'll get gems as rewards. Semi, you get this, and finals, you get this. Okay, it's gonna be just a boring event, guys. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not very excited about this event. Uh, you're gonna not. I don't know how many of you guys will really enjoy this event. I feel like it's gonna be a very, very, very slow event. That's how it's gonna be. That's that. That's how I feel this is gonna be, because I I don't see where we are gonna be able to you know pack all those insane cards that were shown in the promo. Like there was a hundred and three rated uh, player. There were some a few hundred and three rated players. I think you can only get them through these uh, packs. And there is no other way of getting them. Look at this standard packs are there. Hundred ninety seven. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Standard packs are eighty seven to hundred and three. Okay, for a second I thought ninety seven to hundred and three. Now when you go to featured, you can see there is a daily bundle for Liberty Dores ninety seven to hundred and three, like the usual one, and the limited offer. And then there is some Liberty Dores tokens that you can get from using your. Uh, Universal tokens. Okay, there is nothing else new over here. I thought this event is going to be something big. I did not see uh, the event release, the trailer. But you know what? We'll open this. I think this is the only thing we can do in Liberty Torres for today. I don't see anything else. Uh, we will be able to open standard packs. I think maybe one or two, because three thousand goes here. I have seven k left. You can open maybe two of the standard packs and see what that holds. So our first ever Liberty Torres, ninety-seven to hundred and three. Argentina, left wing. Okay, okay. I see how it is. We get a nice ninety-eight Barrios. Oh, oh my God! Look at the pace on this guy. Now this is a left wing card, ninety-eight rated card. Now what did I say? If we get anything better than the cards that we already have. We are gonna bring them into the team. So say bye to Pepe and say hi to Barrios, cause he is gonna go straight into our team. And this is our first, first ever card that we packed in Libertadores event, and he is going to go straight into the team. This is really nice. Now if we rank him, I mean uh, train him, 113 pace, 108 dribbling is mad, guys. Is actually insane. Wait, let us just compare him to our previous left wing. Look at the difference. Look at the difference. That is really nice. I am happy. I know it's only a 98 rated card, but I mean it's something, something new, something new. 
and then what else we can do we can open two i think we can open two standard packs we'll see what if we are lucky or if we are not so we can get garincha mascherano zico zirborto riquelme is also there francisco li milito veron ramirez broha is there vidal is there i think those are the only interesting players that uh, we will be looking at i don't know if anybody else is there probably there will be some 100 rated players but uh, let us just go past these 87 rated wonderful parts i feel like i'm just wasting gems so i'm not gonna open this i'm just gonna save them guys for tomorrow in uh, in the next episode you guys will probably see a oh, few more of these libertadores packs because i feel like it's just a waste don't don't spend your gems on that i don't know why ea are doing this they're just releasing some events just for the sake of it it's not that great i'm not i'm not gonna lie the cards look nice but how do you get cards unless you spend a ton of money you're not gonna pack anybody good or even anybody remotely decent we have to wait for uh, our lovely mr rk reddy's videos because he spends a lot of money in the game and we have to see whether he gets anything remotely decent out of uh, putting all those uh, you know uh, so much money in the game okay when you do that thingy or is that easter egg you get a ball is that good i don't know now you get another easter egg here you get an anniversary community 8 uh, badge and a 96 rated insignia okay for week 4 nobody has been added in anniversary i think literally nobody has uh, nobody has been added even icons nobody prodigy nobody so just focused on the new event i guess okay now looking at our uh, anniversary event itself i did say in yesterday's video that we'll be looking at anniversary event and we'll be looking at team of the week whom we can pack and what we can do oh we get three three to three eggs this time nice how nice of them to give us free 95 rated players that i'm gonna spend in some time make sure you watch till the end of the video we're gonna open so, uh, one more uh, at least one more what do you say that exchange guys anniversary exchange so i'll i'll show you guys if you pack anything insane in this otherwise i'm just gonna complete this and we'll move on to the next one i don't know what you have to do in this okay i just did once and i completed this apparently i have to do this 15 times to get a 97 to 100 rated player will we get somebody that we need okay we got something striker who is this who is this from oh larson Okay, we get another 95 rated card. That is... Uh, okay. If we get Masher now, that will be nice. Because I want to upgrade uh, Jude Bellingham. Masher now is absolutely the number one priority. But doesn't look like there will uh, there's gonna be any Masher now looking our way today. Okay, we need to do one more to complete this. We have only got a 95 rated player. So, we have got a reward from 94 to 99 thingy. And then we've just got this 150k coins a lot. And we've got nothing else. But at least we have finished this anniversary event successfully. Wait a minute. There are ad people added in this. No, I am so confused. Was McTominay already there? Was Sancho already there? Olise was already there. Maybe these guys were already there and I didn't pay attention. But if we get Sancho or uh, somebody 100 rated, it'll be nice. We have got 100 rated Todibo from this by the way, so we can probably, it's gonna be a 97, it's, it's a 97 rated guy, Undav, who, no it is, um, yeah, Fulkrug, it is a 98 rated striker, it is a decent card, I'm not gonna lie, it's a decent card, but we can't use him, because we already have Hendrix as striker, so we have completed this event as well, now we get a 99 to 101, rated card here will this be we can we get the hair can we get the hair or a good hundred rated card if we get a 99 it's not gonna be of much choose and a, a hundred or one not one is where i'm looking at spin spin gk oh milano who is this morata 101 morata let us go i'll happily take 101 morata Spanish, oh my god, from Milan, 101 Morata, I'll happily take him guys, I need a striker as well, 101 rated for my main main lineup, 
so morata i will absolutely take he is one of my favorite players by the way for striker i, I i'll happily i'm not even complaining right now now we get another daily offer here so i think that is going to have a 97 rated card in it 97 to 103 uh, who is this gonna be scott mctominay no mcginn no oh it is scott mctominay so annu okay no wait this anniversary pack is like a base pack is it okay i thought it was like a bundle you know what today's episode is going decent I, I i expected a lot from this particular event but it was very very disappointing but in general i feel like you guys will have enjoyed please leave a comment if you guys have enjoyed it really helps out and we can get a center midfield or a right back center midfield a right back right back we're not gonna go we need a center midfielder so Gravenberg might be our new center midfielder in the future episodes or in today's episode no not in today's episode in the future episodes in the future episodes guys not in today's episode because we don't have a 96 plus dutch player you know what this is this is nice this key thing is nice who is gonna be our left back the team of the week is in ah oh, it's a 95 rated squad why 95 rated teams are not nice See, the highest rated is a 98 uh, Grealish. It's not nice. There is no left back also, decent left backs. Our left back is going to be 94, is it? Oh my god. We have a 92 rated left back. You know what, guys? I think for today's episode, decent it has been. We have tried to open what? We opened two com uh, Libertadores related packs. We got a 98 rated player who has gone straight into the team and then we got Alvaro Morata who is going to go into this team as well because we did pack him here and we need like a substitute for who is this we need a substitute for Hendrix so we have finally got ourselves a 100 rated squad which is absolutely amazing whom did we pack in today's video did we pack anybody good in today's video it's another striker we packed today Okay, you know what? I'll take this squad. We can add uh, Insignia, but uh, then it'll go down to 99. 100-rated squad, guys. 100-rated squad. I am happily going to take this. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, new week is here, but it's going to be a struggle. From next episode onwards, we are going to sit and grind and grind and try to upgrade uh, all these players uh, that we have packed. And we need to improve. We need to improve. So, yeah. I will see you guys in the next episode. Until then, take care, stay safe. I hope you guys saw the yesterday's video in which I uh, told you guys the new rules for this whole RTG series. So yeah, take care guys. Bye-bye.